Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play Spelunky. This will be episode 8, and it's it's been a good series so far. If you might remember last time we played as this guy, uh, but today we are going to go as Mr. Mustachio. So last time we we uh, we tried using the jungle shortcut. We weren't too successful in it, but we we did manage to get there using the mines way. So usually there's two bottles. Why is or usually there's one bottle? Why is there two? I'm not doing two player, am I? Uh, so that's different. Uh, the walls are shifting. That's what usually happens if you're new to this. Which hopefully you aren't, because uh, we're on episode eight. So maybe head on over to episode one if you want to be all caught up and educated and you know stuff that you don't like to hear. Uh, so we have a damsel, which we can easily easily get to, and. Uh, some enemies that will easily hurt us if they want to, as that one did. Rat, attack. Okay, don't. Um, uh, um, mm, not off to a good start, so uh, let's just restart. So, yeah, we didn't have very much going for us, so uh, no shame in uh, just ending things like that. At least not, I don't think there's shame in that. Maybe you guys do. Hopefully, don't. You don't, because uh, well, I, I doubt. I doubt I'll be doing that very much. But anyhow, um, there's our damsel again, and he is uh, behind a trap. So uh, we'll have to deal with that. We we'll have to defuse it, cut the red wire, etc. Uh, we can use a rope, or we can use a bomb. I find uh, bombs more valuable, so I'll use a rope. And uh, there's our rock, and there's our dog. Rockin' dog. Okay, that was scary. Um, so yes, jungle will be a good place to get to. If we can uh, manage that, then I have good ideas of where we're going in life. Not really, but uh, oops. Um, after that is the ice caves, which uh, in Spelunky Classic I was able to get to. Um, I forget if I would start off in the mines or the jungle to get to the uh, ice caves. It was probably it's probably the jungle that I started off in. So the plan for today is that we're going to try the mines, and once we get fed up with that, we're going to go straight to the jungle, um, assuming that we die a lot. That's the one scenario in which we start off in the jungle. I hear snakes, so I, I do like these levels. Um, because, as I've mentioned before probably, the pickaxe is always there and there's always a lot of gems and treasure. So there's our crate. And we could use a rock to uh, do some damage, but that's okay. Uh, we'll just do it the old-fashioned way. Not really worth going through um, the cobweb to get over there. And we also have a damsel, which is uh, pretty awesome. Oops. So I've actually missed her, but that's okay, because uh, I've got ropes. I mean, what are ropes meant for, right? They're meant for uh, roping, roping your way up in life. And we'll also get a gem, which is uh, also cool. First off, let's uh, let's bomb this. So uh, now we have a pickaxe and damsel. So we'll have to uh, we'll have to manage that. I could actually sacrifice her right here now, but I won't uh, because I feel like health is better in the long run. So uh, it's pretty awesome that we got the X-ray specs because uh, now we can kind of see where the the gems are. And I believe that those that, that uh, square thing that fell could have actually ended our lives if I went under it. So it's a good thing I didn't. Uh, that's never happened to me before, but it just kind of occurred to me that that could happen. Um, I think that gem's in his shop, so it's probably... He's probably going to be territorial about it. But that's understandable, I guess. So more gold for me. And... Is it worth going up? 
I mean, I think we have a lot of time, so uh, let, let's do it. We are running low on ropes, but that's okay, I guess. So, yes, I, I was just being conscious of the, the boulder that could have killed us. Would you call it a, a boulder if it's square? I don't know. Um, I just called it one, so uh, hopefully you do. Um, we're definitely not going to use another rope to get up there, and we're just going to get to the exit, I would say. Without falling on spikes, usually a good way to get to the exit. Six bombs, one rope. Uh, things are a little bit um, on the spectrum there, but that's okay. The nice thing about the uh, pickaxe is that we can easily just, uh, as you saw, disable those traps if they're right, right next to us. Don't like these spikes, uh, nothing good that way. So we're just gonna move on this way. Um, X-ray specs also show you other items in the walls too, because uh, sometimes there might be capes, that kind of thing. Uh, please come with me, pickaxe. Oh, darn it. There goes my one health that I earned. That I rightfully earned. But that's okay, I guess. I mean, it's meant to be lost. And, uh, I'm just gonna explore some more. Actually, we can just use the pickaxe to activate these. It's another option. So, I'm keeping an eye out for treasure and also the damsel. And also, uh, the chest and key. Either one, whichever one I see first. Uh, so that's why I kind of just want to see the area to the left, if I can uh, jump over there. Yes, so uh, let's look up. Okay, let's not look up. Uh, I don't see it. And let's look down. There's our damsel, so that's pretty cool. So I'm just going to use that. And I guess I'm not going that way. That was scary. And take that. It's kind of weird to use the uh, pickaxe to kill enemies. So uh, there's a damsel. Skeleton's not doing anything. We'll mind this, of course. And I don't know. Just don't want to accidentally fall in the trap. And I don't know if there's a way to mine that um, sapphire which, without going all the way up there. Anything else? We have a shopkeeper. Um, not too much. A little bit of gold there. Not really worth it. We'll just move on. Uh, doing pretty good on gold. And we just left right in the nick of time. So that's pretty good. Didn't get quite as much gold, but I mean, there's always going to be more like right now. So there's that to look forward to. I didn't do anything, bro. What's this cheese? Oh, he's using a freeze gun. That's funny. Um, hmm. Interesting. He's out of the shop. D did he kill himself? Yeah, he jumped on the spikes. Thank you, bro. Broski. Um, yeah, so cool, we got free items, but at the same time now every shopkeeper is going to want to kill us. So, uh, kind of a trade-off. Uh, climbing gloves, uh, quite appeal to me. Same with the shotgun, actually. Shotgun probably more so than, uh... Whoa, I forgot about that. Oh, it killed itself too, okay. Luckily I didn't land on the spikes and end, it, end myself. So now we have a shotgun idle there. We could actually do very well on this. Um, I kind of want to mine a bit. I also want the Ujet Eye. So uh, just trying not to land on this. Oh, it broke. Okay. Get out of here. So I uh, guess we'll take the chest with us. We have the climbing gloves which will provide us with a way to get back up, hopefully, to uh, where we need to go. 
there a key up there? Not that I can tell. Hopefully we don't have to uh, worry about going there. So drop that there. And get the shoddy. If I could just find the key, that would make things easier for everyone. Key. Where art thou? There's the damsel. And there's so much stuff that we need to deal with. Well, a lot of stuff. Uh, I don't see the key there. And it's not there, is it? So, where is it? Damsel's that way, so, uh, do we just blow our way in? I guess so. Uh, so, there we go. Oh, okay, we've got to get out of here, apparently. So, uh, I'll take the shotgun, I guess so much for the Ujet Eye. Too bad you can't kill the ghost, although I guess that would be kind of stupid. No damsel, but we did get a lot of items. This is shaping up to be quite the uh, good run. Oh, we have to leave the shotgun for this? Oh, that's lame. I mean, it's kind of hard to do this uh, with the shotgun, I think. It's not impossible, but it's just harder to see, of course. Actually, we could use it to kill uh, Big Froggy. It's quite large. Cool. Doesn't he usually drop uh, springy shoes? That's what I thought. But if he didn't, that's okay. I mean, they kind of throw me off balance anyways. So, um, the nice thing about torches is that even if you manage to, uh, get them in the water, you can always relight them using, uh, a previous torch, which makes sense. Okay, we're gonna have to leave the shotgun here unless, unless we bomb our way. Actually, first let's, uh, let's get the monkeys dead so they don't bother us. Sorry, bros. Had to do it. Had to be done. If I was really good, I would just come back for the shotgun, but I'm not that good. Hate to break it to you. These things have usually ended my life, but not today. Not gonna go that way. I'm gonna drop this so we can see and also kill that thing. That worked out. There's our damsel. Uh, where's the exit, though? That's the, uh, that's the burning question in everyone's head. Okay, that was scary. Um, just had a few scary moments in this uh, dark level. Okay, didn't know that was there. Well, I knew, but I forgot. Man, that was going so well, and then he's just, uh, you know, just kind of devoured us. Uh. Let's just start off in the jungle this time. Yes, those uh, man-eating plants, kind of, kind of a big deal. I like how the tunnel man has a picture of a shovel. It's like, all he wanted to do was be the tunnel man. Okay, that was a bad story, I apologize. But um, we have a crate, so uh, let's just drown our sorrows in the bombs. And, uh, gonna get this, of course. So I'm hoping that, uh, maybe if I just start off in the jungle enough times, oopsies, then, uh, I'll get used to kind of, like, the traps and the enemies, and then later on when I'm getting to the jungle from the mines, then I'll just be like, yeah, okay, I can, I can handle this. So, uh, boomerangs are a good weapon, actually. But they could also kill you, as you might expect. And I took the fall damage. But I live to tell the tale. Um, there's our damsel. So we'll take this. Then we'll get our damsel. Perfect. Go 
Okay, less perfect. Uh, oops, that was supposed to be a rope. Rope, go! Oh. Good thing I needed a rope anyways. But I couldn't climb fast enough. Uh, that doesn't count as a run. I don't know what you're talking about. Let's try and kill it. Kill it dead? No, we can't actually do damage to it. It'll just hang out. Uh, don't like frogs. Don't like piranhas. And vines are okay. I like vines. Uh, although there's not too much up there. And, uh, hey, why don't we try getting to that, uh, secret level? Well, I don't know if it's a secret, but, uh, it's definitely not what you'd expect. Can I jump? Yeah, okay. Oh! I wanted to be in there. Missed it again. Does it only go for the damsel? Because when I've seen it, that's how it works. Yeah, I think I think you just need the damsel to get in. So, uh, maybe next time. Uh, we did take fall damage. Sorry, buddy. Oops, sorry, again. Um, bats meet rock. Okay. Interesting. Um, I think I've done enough damage in this video, so I'll end it here. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.